Here we have a 2019 19 plate BMW X5 XDrive 30D M Sport. Now this vehicle does come with four superb unscratched, unmarked 21 inch alloy wheels, all wrapped in Pirelli P0 tyres. Now just hiding behind we do have the blue M Sport brake calipers. Now it does come with the LED headlights, black kidney goals, full M Sport styling kit so you do get the black front splitter, side gate extensions, rear boot spoiler and also a rear diffuser. Now there's a quick look at another superb alloy wheel. Now stepping back you can see we do have the black window trim with the privacy glass on the rear. We also have the shark for antenna and also roof bars just up there as well. Now there's a quick look at another superb alloy wheel. Now this vehicle does come with front and rear parking sensors, 360 degree cameras, dual exhaust flush for the rear bumper and also the rear diffuser. Now we do have a power assisted rear tailgate, as you can see works just fine there. Now we do have the split fold tailgate so you press this button just there and then it unlocks the split fold tailgate as you can see just there. Now you can also lower the car at the rear by pressing that button which makes it easier for putting luggage into the rear. Now you do also have that luggage load liner cover just there as well. Now that's also power assisted back down again. Now this vehicle is free from any major marks, dents or scratches and rear does look superb from every angle. But there's a quick look at another superb alloy wheel. Now if you go to the rear I'll show you a bit of the interior. Now as you can see we do have full leather throughout with isofix points, pull down leather armrest with two nice size cup holders and you also have storage just in there as well. You have storage behind the driver and passenger seat, storage in the centre console by the vent and the 12 volt connectivity. Now on the doors do you have the electric windows with the integrated hand can speakers, bearing with the individual trim with the ambient lighting and brush metal trim there as well. Going to the front, there's a look at the driver's front seat. It's extremely comfortable and there's also heated electric and memory. There's a quick look at the driver's front seat with the extended fire support. Now on your doors you do have your electric windows with your electric power phone and mirrors, your memory seat function, button for the rear tailgate. Now for your BMW individual trim with your integrated hard and cotton speakers, again the ambient lighting with the brushed metal trim. Now jumping inside the car, now looking just down there, you have your auto lights sitting in fully. You do have keyless start, so foot on the brake, press the button, and the vehicle will then start. As you can see, we do have the digital dash there in front of me as well. Now this vehicle has done, if I scroll through these settings, just over 17,190 miles, and it's free for many warning lights on the dashboard. So it has done just under 17,200 miles. Now we do have a multifunction steering wheel with cruise control and speed launches on that on the left hand side. With paddle shift just behind if we wish to take the car into manual mode. You also have your auto wipers there as well and your BC to change through all the values on the side screen there. As you can see we do have the satellite navigation in front of me as well. Now when you put it through the different drive modes the screen actually changes. So Eco Pro and Sports do change as well. Now do also have the heads up display. As you can see just in front of you just there. As you can see just there. Now coming to the centre we do have the big satellite navigation screen in the centre which is also touch screen. Now if we go on to back onto maps we do have your satellite navigation with navigation. Media connectivity where you do have DAB radio. We also have Spotify, music collection, Bluetooth audio, screen mirror and also mobile devices. We have Bluetooth phone connectivity there as well. Now pop it into reverse you can see the 360 degree camera. We can also change through the cameras just there as well. Now pop it back into park and go back. We do have different drive modes, so we do have sports, with sports plus and individual, comfort and also eco. Now eco you can see all your driving data, so what MPG you're using on eco as well. We do have adaptive, so click on adaptive, predictive adjustments on vehicle settings for the driving situation. Now we do have the air suspension, so you can lower the suspension, so if I click there we go, as you can see just there, it lets you know what it's currently at and what it's going down to. So you can lower and raise the suspension. Now if I go and press home and scroll across, you also have all these different functions just there. So if you're driving style analysis, you also have the date and time, also the weather and a bit of news just down there as well. Now if I go down to apps, you can find Apple CarPlay and Android Auto just there and all these different apps there as well. 
Now coming down here, you have your dual zone climate control, which works just as you would expect it to. As you can see, just there, with ice cold aircon. You also have two heated front seats, so if there's cold winter mornings, it really does make all the difference. We have the BMW individual trim all around this vehicle with the ambient lighting, as you can see, all around. Pop this open, just there. You have your wireless charger with storage, USB connectivity, 12 volt connectivity, and two nice size cup holders. This is what you use to control F happens on the screen if you're not using the touchscreen function. We have electric parking brake with auto hold, drive mode select, parking, traction control on and off, parking sensors, parking camera, and also stop, start on and off. Now this is what you use to lower and raise the suspension. Soft touch lever armrest with storage just underneath as well from the touch of a button. And there's a look at the passengers, full lever front seat again with the extended fire support. Now again, you have the BMW individual trim all around this vehicle, which is a very nice addition. Now this vehicle is available to take away today with free contactless nationwide next day delivery. This HBI clear comes with fresh service and we do offer competitive low finance. Thank you very much for watching. Video test drive of this BMW X5 X Drive 30D M Sport. Now the purpose of this video test drive, of course, is to show the vehicle drives exactly how you would expect it to. Now, as you can see, I'm not to fight the up to keep it in straight lines going straight and true, not very enough to the left or to the right hand side. Now we do have cruise control speed limiter on the left hand side of the multifunction steering wheel. Now to activate the cruise control, simply push the button at the bottom in the middle and it'll go to the nearest miles an hour. Push up very slightly on the toggle on the left hand side or just by one and push up until you a bit of a click and it'll just to the nearest five miles an hour. Now the roundabout I'm going to take left as you would if you test drive this vehicle today. And coming out the roundabout I'm going to use the paddle shift. So drop it down a gear, currently in fourth, into third, back into fourth, into fifth, and then we're going to let the car tip back over, let's just let it go. Now you can push the gear stick to the left hand side as well, which will put you in M or S. Now S being sports mode, so it goes through the rev range a lot longer and sharpens up those gear changes. Now it's put back into drive simple, just push back into the right hand side. Now we do have very comfortable full leather seats in this vehicle, which are also heated electric and memory. You can quite easily do two, three, even four miles in this vehicle and still get out feeling fresh. We also have the integrated Harman Kardon speakers, which do sound absolutely incredible. Now we do have the big satellite navigation screen in the centre with gesture control. So I'm going to do it rows over here so it doesn't connect. You go like that and it turns the volume up and so forth and so forth. Now we do have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto with Bluetooth Media, Bluetooth Audio connectivity. We also have DAV Radio. We also have 360 view cameras when you put it into reverse. Now, here are our car sales for our five star dealership with over 305 star views on Google, Auto Trader, and Car Gurus. Now, if you read through the reviews, our customers really do agree with the factor how good you are to buy for and how caring of a company we actually are. Now, if you test drive this vehicle today, you've been listening to our video once knocks or bangs. If you've been listening to during this test drive video, there hasn't been any, which is always a bonus when buying a used car. But right now, we're going to industrial state, but I'm going to take a right, I'm going to pull on, and then she stop, probably straight into reverse, just to show you that the brakes work exactly how I would expect them to. And you'll see pop up in the centre screen, the rear with well, about three inches of three cameras. So pulling in now, make sure you stop in three, two, one, hard onto the brakes, straight into reverse, no issues whatsoever. You can see the rear camera there with the top down view, pop it into drive, and it'll switch around to the front view, on, as you can see on the right hand side. Now, if you haven't answered all of your questions and inquiries during this test drive and walk around video, please feel free to get in contact with the sales team, where they can answer any unanswered questions and also run through some inquiries with you. But that's it for me in this walk around video and video test drive. Hope to hear from you soon. Cheers.